It will be their fourth debate and the first since the impeachment inquiry began. Twelve Democrats who want to be president will be on stage in about 90 minutes or so. But two Pennsylvania Democrats are warning the candidates to think about how their words could help or hurt them in our region. Political editor John Delano has a preview. When the Democrats hit the stage near Columbus, questions are likely to focus on impeachment, Bernie Sanders' medical comeback from a heart attack, and Elizabeth Warren's rise to number one in some national polls. But locally, two Democrats who won Democratic counties that President Trump carried are warning the candidates to watch what they say so as not to lose moderate to conservative Democratic votes in Western PA. I would just advise all of these candidates to think a little more carefully about the issue. Issues like guns, trade, steel, and coal come to mind, and especially fracking of natural gas, which some candidates want to ban. The false choice is you have to choose um, fracking over uh, good climate policy. Senator Bob Casey says natural gas is a clean fossil fuel that must be regulated but not banned because it has made the U.S. less dependent and which creates, as we know, a lot of jobs in, in Pennsylvania. So far, Elizabeth Warren, Bernie Sanders, Kamala Harris, Cory Booker, and Tulsi Gabbard have called for a ban on fracking. They are wrong, says Congressman Lamb. We say that we're the party of the working class and the middle class. Uh, we don't pick favorites. You know, energy jobs are middle class jobs and people are working hard and buying their first house and putting their kids through school on the jobs that have been provided by natural gas development and by the cracker plant. Which is why words and debates can come back to haunt. Now a fifth debate has already been scheduled in Georgia for Wednesday, November 20th, the week before Thanksgiving. And although the rules have been tightened, at least eight Democrats have already qualified. The first votes, well, they'll be cast in Iowa on February 3rd and New Hampshire on February 11th. In downtown Pittsburgh, I'm John Delano, KDKA News.